reflect the substantial issues that we wish to address, putting the interests of the peoples of ASEAN at the center of its work. High quality of life, enhancing an environment that is conducive to business, prioritizing health and improved nutrition, promoting peaceful coexistence, advancing work on maritime security, highlighting connectivity and innovation, building a disaster resilient region, and strengthening ASEAN's work and standing in the international arena. We do this with the mindset that a prosperous, peaceful, and dynamic region also ultimately redounds to the welfare and the future of our own people. Well, ASEAN celebrates its 50th founding anniversary under our chairmanship, we we'll also look at the milestone we have reached with the 40th anniversary of its partnership with the United States of America. ASEAN-US cooperation inputs into our community building efforts and has helped propel the region's unprecedented economic success uninterrupted by any major armed conflict. We fully echo ASEAN's sentiment for the continued and active engagement in the region of the United States. We look forward to President Donald Trump's attendance at the leaders' meetings this coming November and the United States' renewed commitment to the strategic partnership that forges a common path towards a peaceful, stable, and prosperous Asia-Pacific region. Recent expressions of strong bipartisan congressional support for the importance of ASEAN-US relations have also been very positive developments. We have high hopes that the ASEAN Congressional Caucus will broaden and deepen that engagement. The United States has also been an enduring and reliable ally of the Philippines. The United States is our only, is our only treaty ally. The Philippines is also the United States' oldest ally in Asia. <clears throat> our friendship is decades long reinforced by an alliance that continues to stand strong, whether in good or challenging times. We welcome the words of support from the United States in our effort to combat the scourge of terrorism in our country. The Philippines stands resolute in its commitment to protect the safety and welfare of all of its citizens from threats posed by these criminal groups. The people-to-people -people ties between our nations have also strengthened our bonds to no end. Filipinos and Americans share a mutual fondness for one another defined by respect and bountiful affinity. The spirit of goodwill is cross-generational and will certainly continue to contribute to sustaining our relations. The Filipino-American community is an essential pillar of this dynamic construct and will always play a positive force in the many facets of the robust relations between our two countries. Filipino Americans have it in themselves to be empowered and to demonstrate their strength to support initiatives that promote the mutual interests of both the Philippines and the United States. We also recognize the work of the U.S.-Philippines Friendship Caucus in further enhancing the bilateral relationship through its active promotion of the close linkages between the two countries in the U.S. Congress. 